Engineers at Google, scientists at NASA, for kids who are into science, these are their heroes. And some local students got a chance to connect with them and learn during a virtual festival. WCNC Charlotte's Ruby Durham takes us to STEM Fest 2021. STEAM FEST HAS BEEN SOMETHING THAT WE'VE BEEN DOING AT WOODLAWN SCHOOL FOR A NUMBER OF YEARS. STUDENTS GET HANDS ON SCIENCE AND ART EXPERIENCE AT THE FREE EVENT IN DAVIDSON. STEAM FEST ISN'T REALLY LIKE A SCIENCE FAIR WHERE KIDS SHOW OFF THEIR WORK. IT'S, it's MORE AN OPPORTUNITY FOR KIDS TO COME AND PLAY. LAST YEAR, THE EVENT HOSTED OVER 400 STUDENTS, BUT DUE TO THE CORONAVIRUS, THOSE INVOLVED CREATED ANOTHER WAY FOR STUDENTS TO PLAY. We uh, we didn't want to say no. We didn't want to we didn't want to give up. We didn't want to lose momentum after having such a great year. To keep the momentum going, students and parents took it upon themselves to create this website, Steamfest.org. It has over 100 free science and art activities for students to enjoy, but at home. Uh, some of them they can work on on their own. Some of them they can work with their uh, family. They even use school resources to recruit engineers at Google and some popular YouTube creators to help make it all happen. And we've got a couple of scientists from NASA who are doing uh, live stream events and have contributed content to the site. To keep it challenging, prize drawings are also up for grabs for anybody who completes an activity and logs it. Including, you know, microscope slides, an attachment to put your cell phone on it and take pictures, whatever you're looking at. Um, we have uh, coming up this weekend a uh, telescope package that will be the uh, grand prize for the weekend. Woodlawn School in Davidson finding new ways to keep students engaged in the middle of this pandemic. Ruby Durham, WCNC Charlotte.